So you want to use ChatGPT to answer a few questions. If you don't know what ChatGPT is to answer questions, I mean, it's an amazing place. You are probably not going to be using uh, Google anymore because in my case, that's a way of how we can just start to actually working. If you are having some essays for your own projects, for work, for personal usage, um, if you have any questions, you can open any tab and here you have the Google tab, right? And here into the Google tab, I want to uh, I want the answer of what are the type of bodies? Enter mark. And we have some, most people are unique combination of the three body types, ectomorph, mesomorph, and endomorph. So can I do this into ChatGPT as well? If you go into the chat.openar.com, uh, here's going to be appearing a, a lot of sections. Of course, you want to have an account, you want to sign up, you can use a Google account or a Microsoft account. It's going to be just really, really simple. But once you do have this one available, you want to ask uh, for whatever question you can do. So for example, if I typed a new chat, here I have my different versions, so I can ask the same question. What are the types of bodies? Enter mark. And ChatGPT is going to be answering our question. Sometimes this might be taking a little bit more than Google. Sometimes this actually takes just less than one second. But this is totally depending on how many people are inside ChatGPT. So as you can see, ChatGPT gave us a very detailed answer. There are several types of body, including solid bodies, liquid bodies, gas bodies, plasma bodies, composite bodies. So if you are looking for, uh, let's say, that you want to figure out what kind, how do I know? How do I know what type of body do I have? Do I have? So as you can see, this is a conversation between you and the chat APD. So that's the reason why this is an artificial, an artificial intelligence that can be helping you to answer almost any question. So to determine what type of body you have, you can look at several factors, including your, your physical characteristics, your body composition, and blah, 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 blah. So you can still have a conversation with artificial intelligence, something that you cannot do into Google. So I believe that's the reason why ChatGPT so far is doing so popular right now. So uh, with that being said, guys, this is the reason, this is, that's the way of how we can use the chat DPD, how we can start some different chats. You want to have one conversation, one subject into one chat. If you want to talk about, let's say, something else, let's say about chemistry or Spanish or Italian, you want to go into new chat. And here you want to have your new subject it's because this one's going to be helping us to train the artificial intelligence a little bit more so you can have more accurate answers of what you're actually looking for. So with that being said, guys, we have reached the very end of the video. Hopefully this was very useful for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.